gastrostomy tube, mic key button, eating and drinking properly, as well as taking in enough food and fluids by mouth for optimum growth and nutrition, can be difficult for certain youngsters. Dr. Mathula Hetayrechi, consultant pediatric surgeon, is shown here inserting a gastrostomy tube. In this scenario, a gastrostomy tube may be a beneficial tool in assisting your child in meeting the appropriate dietary objectives. A mic key button is a little tube that allows children to receive feed, fluids, and medication straight into their stomach. Is a gastrostomy button required for my child? If your doctor believes your kid may require dietary assistance, you will be referred to the pediatric surgery clinic for evaluation. During the appointment, we will explore if a gastrostomy tube is required and give you with the resources you need to make an informed decision. To keep the button in place, a tiny balloon is inflated on the interior of the button. Surgical installation of a gastrostomy button. Gastrostomy tubes are routinely implanted laparoscopically in the operating room under general anesthesia in less than 30 minutes. A small camera is put via the belly button during the surgery, and an instrument is used to push the stomach closer to the abdominal wall so that a gastrostomy tube can be implanted into the stomach from the outside. To keep the button in place, a tiny balloon is inflated on the interior of the button. What occurs following surgery? When the surgery is over and your kid is fully awake, he or she will be transported to an observation unit where our nursing staff will assure his or her comfort. We will usually start using the gastrostomy button for feedings within four hours. You will be given the required equipment and education for home release, as well as the opportunity to practice using the feeding tube. Your youngster will most likely be released the same day or early the following day. Visit clinic.lk for more information and we are located in Kandy, Sri Lanka.